So this section right here is where we actually filmed the Permission to Dance Challenge. Toxic solo stand behavior. ARMY as a whole, the greatest fandom in the world. I've been a part of many fandoms, many fandoms. The ups is we're positive, we are strong, we are vital to this world, you know what I'm saying? We defend BTS, you know, where they when they need us and we're there for BTS when they need us. Um, the downside is solo stand behavior. So solo stand behavior is becoming more prevalent on the channel because we're growing. I, I, I figured that would happen, uh, but to actually see it going on is disturbing. Solo stand behavior to me is something that is not only annoying, but it's unacceptable. Um, because at the end of the day, BTS is about seven. Seven individuals who come together to share their talents with the world. And each one of them is talented, like Voltron. You, you can't do it without all seven. You can't come together and create this powerhouse of a machine without all seven. It's just impossible. From my perspective, it's like if you don't react a certain way to a solo stance favorite, then all of a sudden you become an enemy or they'll say things that are really disrespectful um, and put unreasonable expectation on us as reactors. Not just us, as in Mika, Blaze, AJJ, and myself, all reactors. For us, reactions are genuine, okay? There is no way that we are going to call out all seven members individually on every video just to make it fair. That's just, that's not going to happen. That's not organic. That's not natural. That's not genuine. Okay. I will say that we do call out every member on every video with the words they and them. Because when you look at them as a whole, you'll see it all the time. You hear it all the time. We're like, oh, wow, they're amazing. Oh, they're awesome. We're talking about all seven at that point. Okay. We're not going to call out every individual, every video. It, it would never be to a solo stand's liking. Our content will never satisfy a solo stand 100% um, because we're not about that solo life. We all have our biases. We all have our favorites. However, if you notice, if you really pay attention to all of our content, and I understand that people don't get to see this stuff on uh, Patreon. Like a lot of people don't get to see this stuff on Patreon because they can't afford to you know, pay for Patreon. I get it. That's cool. You don't get the whole scope of what we do here, what you guys say. I get it. However, even on YouTube, if you really look at all of the content, you'll see that we notice each member from time to time. You know what I'm saying? Like each member stands out to us. And it may not stand out, they may not stand out to us when you want us to as a viewer, right? But that's our natural reaction. You see what I'm saying? We're not purposely ignoring anybody ever. You know, there's a lot of things that you miss on a first reaction. A lot of people, they've had time to see so much in a video before they actually check out our reaction video. Facts. Or at least our reaction video. So they notice all different types of stuff. We're, most of the time, we're watching it the first time, okay? There's just no way you're going to notice everything and everyone, okay? We go back, because we're fans first and react to second, we go back and watch each video we watch a few times, especially depending on how much we like it is how much we're going to watch it again. And in our own time, we notice the things that we don't notice on camera. We notice the people that we don't necessarily call out and notice when we're on camera because it's just so much going on, right? Um, but it's, it's, it's just, it's designed to be organic. It's designed to be genuine. And when you expect, like you as a viewer, if you, if you as a solo stand, I should say, expect us to focus in on your favorite all the time, then it, if we if we follow suit, it becomes fake, okay? It will become completely fake. And we, we're not doing that, man. We're, we're absolutely not doing that. Solo stand behavior in the comments and stuff, nothing I can do about that. Um, it's what you gotta say. You say what you gotta say unless you're being disrespectful. However, however, I don't pay attention to those comments. I scroll and I ignore. Yep. There's some content creators, they focus on a certain member more so than the others, okay? If you want that, you gotta go there for that. Okay, you can't come to what you guys say and expect that. You can't, you can't knock them off. You can't be like, no, they're not army. They're not this. They, they are army. You know, they are army, and um, I, I, I just can't relate to it. I can't relate to it. So, you know, I don't want no part of it. Tell everybody goodbye. Bye bye. Hey, no, no, no. Don't come over here. 
No, important business. No, no, important business. No pictures. No, important business. Oh my God, bro.